Synonyms Benevolence, favor, kindness, mildness, benignity, forbearance, lenience, pardon, blessing, forgiveness, leniency, pity, clemency, gentleness, lenity, tenderness. Compassion, grace. Mercy is the exercise of less severity than one deserves, or in a more extended sense, the granting of kindness or favor beyond what one may rightly claim. Grace is favor, kindness, or blessing shown to the undeserving, forgiveness, mercy, and pardon are exercised toward the ill-deserving. Pardon remits the outward penalty which the offender deserves, forgiveness dismisses resentment or displeasure from the heart of the one offended, 240 Mercy seeks the highest possible good of the offender. There may be mercy without pardon, as in the mitigation of sentence, or in all possible alleviation of necessary severity, there may be cases where pardon would not be mercy, since it would encourage to repetition of the offense, from which timely punishment might have saved. Mercy is also used in the wider sense of refraining from harshness or cruelty toward those who are in one's power without fault of their own, as, they besought the robber to have mercy. Clemency is a colder word than mercy, and without its religious associations, signifying mildness and moderation in the use of power where severity would have legal or military, rather than moral sanction, it often denotes a habitual mildness of disposition on the part of the powerful, and is matter rather of good nature or policy than of principle. Leniency or lenity denotes an easy-going avoidance of severity, these words are more general and less magisterial than clemency, we should speak of the leniency of a parent, the clemency of a conqueror. Compare 490h pity. Antonyms. Cruelty, implacability, punishment, rigor, sternness. Hardness, justice, revenge, severity, vengeance. Harshness, penalty. Prepositions. The mercy of God to or toward sinners, have mercy on or upon one. Meter. Synonyms. Euphony, measure, rhythm, verse. Euphony is agreeable linguistic sound, however produced, meter, measure, and rhythm denote agreeable succession of sounds in the utterance of connected words. Euphony may apply to a single word or even a single syllable. The other words apply to lines, sentences, paragraphs, etc. Rhythm and meter may be produced by accent only as in English, or by accent and quantity combined, as in Greek or Italian, rhythm or measure may apply either to prose or to poetry, or to music, dancing, etc. Semicolon. Meter is more precise than rhythm, applies only to poetry, and denotes a measured rhythm with regular divisions into verses, stanzas, strophes, etc. A verse is strictly a metrical line, but the word is often used as synonymous with stanza. Verse, in the general sense, denotes metrical writing without reference to the thought involved, as, prose and verse. Compare 491h melody, 492h poetry. 241. Mind. Synonyms. Brain, instinct, reason, spirit, consciousness, intellect, sense, thought, disposition, intelligence, soul, understanding. Mind, in a general sense, includes all the powers of sentient being apart from the physical factors in bodily faculties and activities. In a limited sense, mind is nearly synonymous with intellect, but includes disposition, or the tendency toward action, as appears in the phrase, to have a mind to work. As the seat of mental activity, brain colloquially brains is often used as a synonym for mind, intellect, intelligence. Thought, the act, process, or power of thinking, is often used to denote the thinking faculty and especially the reason. The instinct of animals is now held by many philosophers to be of the same nature as the intellect of man, but inferior and limited, yet the apparent difference is very great. An instinct is a propensity prior to experience and independent of instruction. Paley Natural Philosophy ch. 18. In this sense we speak of human instincts, thus denoting tendencies independent of reasoning or instruction. The soul includes the intellect, sensibilities, and will, beyond what is expressed by the word mind, the soul denotes especially the moral, the immortal nature, we say of a dead body, the soul, not the mind, has fled.
Spirit is used especially in contradistinction from matter, it may in many cases be substituted for soul, but soul has commonly a fuller and more determinate meaning. We can conceive of spirits as having no moral nature, the fairies, elves, and brownies of mythology might be termed spirits, but not souls. In the figurative sense, spirit denotes animation, excitability, perhaps impatience, as, a lad of spirit, he sang with spirit, he replied with spirit. Soul denotes energy and depth of feeling, as when we speak of soulful eyes, or it may denote the very life of anything, as, the hidden soul of harmony, Milton Lallegro L. 144. Sense may be an antonym of intellect, as when we speak of the sense of hearing, but sense is used also as denoting clear mental action, good judgment, acumen, as, he is a man of sense, or, he showed good sense, sense, even in its material signification, must be reckoned among the activities of mind, though dependent on bodily functions, the mind, not the eye, really sees, the mind, not the ear, really hears. Consciousness includes all that a sentient being perceives, knows, thinks, or feels, from whatever source arising and of whatever character, kind, or degree, whether with 242 or without distinct thinking, feeling, or willing, we speak of the consciousness of the brute, of the savage, or of the sage. The intellect is that assemblage of faculties which is concerned with knowledge, as distinguished from emotion and volition. Understanding is the Saxon word of the same general import, but is chiefly used of the reasoning powers, the understanding, which Sir W. M. Hamilton has called, the faculty of relations and comparisons, is distinguished by many philosophers from reason in that, reason is the faculty of the higher cognitions or a priori truth. Antonyms. Body, brawn, brute force, material substance, matter. Minute. Synonyms. Circumstantial, diminutive, little, slender, comminuted, exact, particular, small, critical, fine, precise, tiny. Detailed. That is minute which is of exceedingly limited dimensions, as a grain of dust, or which attends to matters of exceedingly slight amount or apparent importance, as, a minute account, minute observation. That which is broken up into minute particles is said to be comminuted, things may be termed fine which would not be termed comminuted, as, fine sand, fine gravel, but, in using the adverb, we say a substance is finely comminuted, comminuted referring more to the process, fine to the result. An account extended to very minute particulars is circumstantial, detailed, particular, an examination so extended as critical, exact, precise. Compare 493H fine. Antonyms. See synonyms for 494H large. Misfortune. Synonyms. Adversity, disappointment, ill fortune, ruin, affliction, disaster, ill luck, sorrow, bereavement, distress, misadventure, stroke, blow, failure, mischance, trial, calamity, hardship, misery, tribulation, chastening, harm, mishap, trouble, chastisement, ill, reverse, visitation. Misfortune is adverse fortune or any instance thereof, any untoward event, usually of lingering character or consequences, and such as the sufferer is not deemed directly responsible for, as, he 243 had the misfortune to be born blind. Any considerable disappointment, failure, or misfortune, as regards outward circumstances, as loss of fortune, position, and the like, when long continued or attended with enduring consequences, constitutes adversity. For the loss of friends by death we commonly use affliction or bereavement. Calamity and disaster are used of sudden and severe misfortunes, often overwhelming, ill fortune and ill luck, of lighter troubles and failures. We speak of the misery of the poor, the hardships of the soldier. Affliction, chastening, trial, and tribulation have all an especially religious bearing, suggesting some disciplinary purpose of God with beneficent design. Affliction may be keen and bitter, but brief, tribulation is long and wearing. We speak of an affliction, but rarely of a tribulation, since tribulation is viewed as a continuous process, which may endure for years or for a lifetime, but we speak of our daily trials. Compare 495H Catastrophe.
Antonyms Blessing, consolation, gratification, pleasure, success, boon, good fortune, happiness, prosperity, triumph. Comfort, good luck, joy, relief. Mob. Synonyms. Canile, dregs of the people, masses, rabble, crowd, lower classes, populace, the vulgar. The populace are poor and ignorant, but may be law-abiding, a mob is disorderly and lawless, but may be rich and influential. The rabble is despicable, worthless, purposeless, a mob may have effective desperate purpose. A crowd may be drawn by mere curiosity, some strong, pervading excitement is needed to make it a mob. Compare 496 H people. Model. Synonyms. Archetype, facsimile, original, representation, copy, image, pattern, standard, design, imitation, prototype, type. Example, mold. A pattern is always, in modern use, that which is to be copied. A model may be either the thing to be copied or the copy that has been made from it, as, the models in the patent office. A pattern is commonly superficial, a model is usually in relief. A pattern must be closely followed in its minutest particulars by a 244 faithful copyist, a model may allow a great degree of freedom. A sculptor may idealize his living model, his workmen must exactly copy in marble or metal the model he has made in clay. Compare 497H example. 498H idea, 499H ideal. Modesty. Synonyms. Backwardness, constraint, reserve, timidity, bashfulness, coyness, shyness, unobtrusiveness. Coldness, diffidence. Bashfulness is a shrinking from notice without assignable reason. Coyness is a half-encouragement, half-avoidance of offered attention, and may be real or affected. Diffidence is self-distrust, modesty, a humble estimate of oneself in comparison with others, or with the demands of some undertaking. Modesty has also the specific meaning of a sensitive shrinking from anything indelicate. Shyness is a tendency to shrink from observation, timidity, a distinct fear of criticism, error, or failure. Reserve is the holding oneself aloof from others, or holding back one's feelings from expression, or one's affairs from communication to others. Reserve may be the retreat of shyness, or, on the other hand, the contemptuous withdrawal of pride and haughtiness. Compare 500H abash. 501H pride, 502H taciturn. Antonyms. Abandon, boldness, forwardness, impudence, pertness, arrogance, conceit, frankness, indiscretion, sauciness, assumption. Confidence, freedom, loquaciousness, self-conceit, assurance, egotism, haughtiness, loquacity, self-sufficiency, sociability. Money. Synonyms. Bills, cash, funds, property, bullion, coin, gold, silver, capital, currency, notes, specie. Money is the authorized medium of exchange, coined money is called coin or specie. What are termed in England bank notes are in the United States commonly called bills, as, a $5 bill. The notes of responsible men are readily transferable in commercial circles, but they are not money, as, the stock was sold for $500 in money and the balance in merchantable paper. Cash is specie or money in hand, are paid in hand, as, the cash account, the cash price. In the legal sense, property is not money, and money is not property, for property is that which has inherent value, while money, as such, has but representative value, and 245 may or may not have intrinsic value. Bullion is either gold or silver uncoined, or the coined metal considered without reference to its coinage, but simply as merchandise, when its value as bullion may be very different from its value as money. The word capital is used chiefly of accumulated property or money invested in productive enterprises are available for such